Now, a Perth cosmetic surgeon is calling on the government to change the law and enforce a minimum age of 18 for cosmetic injectables. Currently, teens under 18 can get procedures like Botox and lip fillers with consent from a parent or guardian. Dr Vivek Iranki says there's been a huge increase in demand from young girls wanting treatments during COVID. He says other clinics are taking on clients as young as 14 years old. God, uh, Dr Iranki joins us now. Um, appreciate your time. Is giving cosmetic procedures to girls under 18 actually illegal? In Australia, currently, it's not illegal for patients under the age of 18 to have cosmetic injectables. And the reason for this is Botox and fillers are actually a scheduled drug. And many of these drugs can actually be used for non-cosmetic purposes. So, for example, Botox can be used for cerebral palsy and other neuromuscular disorders. So what happens is when it comes to cosmetic reasons of administering these drugs, the onus of it really falls on the doctor. So for that reason, at oh. this point, it's not illegal for patients under the age of 18 to have injectable treatments. Oh, so you got 2,000 calls from young girls last year wanting injectable treatments, yeah. a huge increase. Why? Yeah, so that's 2,000 calls last year from underage patients. So we, on average, we get about 200 calls a day uh, for pa patients wanting injectable treatments. There's many reasons why this is happening, but I think this is a global trend. If you look at America, there's been something like 21,000 Botox treatments being done on patients under the age of 18 back in 2019. And a lot of this is because injectable treatments is being normalized, especially in young people. So if you look at someone like Kylie Jenner, uh, who's famously had her lip injections done, she's had it done when she was 17 years old. And a lot of these celebrities mm. are then basically live streaming their experience when it comes to getting injectable yeah. treatments and this removes the stigma and the phobia of getting the needles and so more and more younger people are finding it comfortable to have these treatments there's been a recent study in the UK that basically showed that in 58 percent of the young girls find that getting injectable treatments is the same as getting your hair done or your nails done. So this just shows mm. us how normal injectable treatments has become, which is scary. Yeah, yeah. it is scary and a great warning. Mm. Um, thank you for telling it today. Mm. Appreciate your time.